Jay Morrissey, and I come from PAT. My name is Zenday Ferbert. I play for Bayless Bay Cricket Club. Sheldon Caesar, I play for Southampton Rangers. Hey, Jordan Lewis, I play for Bayless Bay Cricket Club. Hey, Jordan Caesar, I play for Southampton Rangers. Jordan Smith, and I play for Bayless Bay Cricket Club. My name is Isaiah Richardson, and I'm representing the Somerset Cricket Club. My name is Shinoa B. And Wilson, and I'm representing Somerset Cricket Club. I'm representing PAC. My name is Alex Lewis, I represent Rangers Cricket Club. My name is Michael Simons, I play for Willow Cross Cricket Club. My name is Michael Roman, I'm representing PAC. My name is Azari Painter, I'm representing St. George's Cricket Club. My name is Delray Rollins and I represent Bayless Bay. My name is Sanjay Dill and I play for Work Workmans. My name is Cameron Jefferson and I represent My name is Shaquille Waterbridge and I represent Work Workmans. My name is Corey Smith and I represent Work Workman Cricket Club. My name is Matt Carmichael and I represent all right, Mr. Wade, can you tell us about, a little bit about some of the preparations you've been doing with the boys uh, for their upcoming tournament? Yeah, basically, um, the preparation has been going great. We've been doing a lot of batting skill drills, uh, a lot of fielding drills, and also a lot of bowling drills so that the bowlers can find the lines and lengths, and the batsman could be rotating the strike, playing certain shots, like hitting below the eyes and over the top, which is very vital to, to win this tournament. It must be an all round performer, so you must be good on the field the batting department and the building department. But since January, you know, I've been training hard, working hard, the work's been put in. And I can't ask for nothing more than, you know, what they've been giving me in the training sessions and leading up to this tournament. So the preparation has been great. All right, and what are some of your goals for the tournament coming up? Our goal basically is to, uh, to win this tournament and go to the World Cup. The boys are very, very energy, energetic, energetic about it, looking forward to it. And like I said, the work's been put in, but our main objective is to win the tournament and move forward to the World Cup. And how would you describe the group of boys that you've been given to train and get prepared for this? Uh, they've been very good, very disciplined. You know, they've been listening. They had different uh, classroom sessions for the Mirrors program. They had a uh, legend, Mr. Vincent Kutruck, to come talk to him, give him some motivation skills as far as um, being a great player as he was to get in certain departments, like far as the mental part of the game, you know. So basically all that's been taking place and they'll be responding very well to that. All right, and what are your hopes for uh, supporters coming out and watching them play and seeing what they have to offer? Yeah, I'm looking for the whole public to come out and support this. This is a big event for Bermuda, cricket on a hill. Not just for these youngsters, but the youngsters coming behind them. And you know, after what happened to the senior team in you know in the states in that tournament, this is a great opportunity for, for Bermuda and for like for all the public to come out and support these young men. They worked that double pretty on leading up to the World Cup. So Bermuda, can we all come and give us support and help these young men? All right, thank you very much and good luck.